Hey guys, how you going? Welcome back to another video. Uh, tonight, <laughs> see if we can get anything, and hopefully we can, but it's getting dark out. I wasn't expecting to come out and do this video so late, but uh, today was just absolutely hot, and I didn't want to come out. And um, But yeah, it's looking pretty nice out tonight, and it's the weather's actually quite nice, um, starting to cool down a bit, so see if we can get something in this pond. I said I was going to come back here. This is where we got the... What was it? The perch. The good perch. I got the spangled perch here and I said I would come back and do some traps if enough people were interested. So we're back here now and we're going to see if there's any in here. Alright guys, just using the, the dog food. Got two traps to chuck you out of here. Just a little bit of dog food in each one. I just, um, I did get this underwater case on my phone too so we could get some underwater footage. But I don't know if we'll be able to get any. Maybe we'll see. We'll put the flash on see if we can get some but... If not, it doesn't really matter. Um, I did bring the viewing container, but again, it's dark out, so we might have to have a look at them when we get home if we get anything interesting. So let's get these zipped up and get them put in. All right, guys, just got two traps out. I'm gonna give it maybe 20 minutes, 30 minutes. Getting bitten alive by mosquitoes, should have come more prepared for that. But hopefully we can get something interesting out of here today and I'm really looking forward to see what we can get. Might have to come back here another day though when it's daytime, so see what happens. Alright guys, I just tried to get some underwater footage, not sure how it's going to turn out, but I think I've seen some Gambusia and possibly even some Guppies, so we'll see what happens. I'll have to have a look back at that footage, but just from the glowing of the shimmering of the surface, I've definitely seen the Gambusia and possibly Guppies, so I'm going to pull these traps out. It's been about 20 minutes and um, see if we got anything interesting. Got the viewing container. Let's have a look. Alright, what do we got? We got something in here. Oh yeah, look at that. Is that a guppy? That's a guppy. It's got some guppies in here. Look at that. Wow. There's a couple of them. Have to have a look in the viewing container. Alright, I'll get these out and let's have a look at them. Um, do you have a look in here? Look at some of these guys. There's color on these. Look at that. These don't look too far off their strains either. Like these look like they've only been released like recently in here. If you have a look at the size of that female there, it has a colored tail. Like that's uncommon for pest guppies. But there's even one that has like color on it. Look at that one with the color. Can you see that? Little red tail with a blue fin on the back. What the? This is crazy. <laughs> these are only like just been released in here. That's just. I mean, they're probably a couple of generations in because there is definitely some wild looking ones in there, but that guy there, like, he looks stunning. Can't wait to go back home and have, like, a, a really nice look at these, but that's awesome. So I'm just going to sit that down and we're going to check the other trap and see if we've got anything in there. Might have to come back here after seeing that. Uh, that's got me hyped up. It's rare to see guppies around Gold Coast. Oh, whoa, look at that. What is that? What is that? What is that? What is it? Oh, look at that. No way. <laughs> a scampi. Oh, don't let him get away. We've got a scampi, guys. See if there's any else in here. Man, I thought that there would be more in this one. I've seen more over this side, so I thought that there would definitely be some in here, but that side definitely had them, so that's awesome. No Gambusia or nothing, just a scampi. Definitely have to come back here, even if we only just coming back to get more scampies, because Chunky Boy likes us, likes himself a couple of shrimp. So I'm gonna chuck these guys in the bucket. I didn't bring a, um, I didn't bring an aerator today because we're only just around the corner from a, from home. So just gonna get some water in here. 
make sure there's enough water in there. But yeah, we'll, we'll get home, we'll check these guys out. But some of these guppies look starved, so hopefully we get them home, we can give them a bit of a feed, thicken them up and get a better look at them. But yeah, absolutely crazy guys. I'm so excited about catching that scampi and the, the guppies in here because I was not expecting that, so that's awesome. Um, I forget what this park's called, I'll put the name in the description, but um, it was the video where I caught the spangled perch, I was over the other side on the fishing line, so same place, you guys want me to come here, I'll come here, um, should have come back in a day, probably would have been more active, probably would have caught more stuff, but um, shrimp are definitely nocturnal, so probably would have caught less shrimp, but we got the one shrimp and we'll feed that to Chunky Boy in this video. I don't know about feeding the guppies to him because I might keep those. Anyways, thanks for watching. Stay tuned for the feeding. Hey guys, I was super happy with what we were able to like walk away with from there. Like I was not expecting that at all. Like some of you guys must have known what was in there because you kept telling me to go back. And I was getting comments like even like a month or so after that video dropped about the spangled perch. But yeah, really happy with that. Can't wait to show you guys. I'm just um getting some water into that tank so we can have a look at it out of one of my other tanks and um, I'm gonna put the guppies in there and then we can get a better look at them and see what's going on with all that but for now while waiting for that to fill up um, let's feed Chunky that scampi where is he? Where are you? There he is. I don't think we ever get much footage of him on this side of the tank so see if we can get him to eat over here now. I'm not going to feed him the guppies because I want to have like a better look at them, but um... That's wicked, eh? <laughs> That's a bit... Look at that, he came straight up for that. He's excited when he's seen that. Come on over here. Come over here. See if we can bait him over. Whoa. The scampi got away from me. Oh, are you serious? I didn't get that on film. Oh, damn it. He hasn't had shrimp in so long, so he's probably like excited for that. Like that's childhood memories of him, <laughs> to be honest with you. All those months ago, you know, I used to just feed him up on shrimp. So he's having the flashbacks to when he was a, a young barra. <laughs> Yeah, that's really cool. He's super excited, but yeah, I'll get this tank some soft siphoned into you, some water siphoned in this tank. I just grabbed it from the outside. I had rainwater in a box. Probably better off just to have the treated tank water in it for now. And um, we'll have a look at those fish. All right, guys. There's some guppies in. Where's that big one? Is it? There he is there. That's gotta be a female there. It's not looking too crunch shot though. Might be dead. Did I just kill it? Put... No, it's still alive. It's struggling though. It's uh, looks a bit inbred. But yeah, these, look at that one up the back there, that little male with the orange tail. Some of these are like really wild and then some of them are like not too far off, like <laughs> something you'd see in a mixed guppy aquarium. So that's absolutely crazy. Look at that guy. Wow. He's cool. But that female there, hey, like she, has a really bad poor back so that's a sign of inbreeding so just got the torch on top but also yeah i found this um i forgot to mention i did find some gambies here in that trap as well i just dispatched this guy you're not supposed to bring these home it was an accident but it was a dead honest accident so boom <laughs> dispatch of that guy um yeah, look at these guys. These are 100% guppies. A couple of females in the back, this female here. Is that a male or a female? It's pretty big and it might be a male. But yeah, look at that. Honestly, guys. Yeah, really, really good spot, guys, for some guppies. So we're gonna have to go back down there and catch some more. But yeah, thanks for the suggestion to go back down there because I definitely wouldn't have gone down there for traps. I didn't really think there was much in there other than getting busy off, but really excited about that now, so. Thanks for watching guys, hope you guys enjoyed this video and um, stay tuned for more. We'll get back to the reg regular scheduling of um, the episodes of the new series. And yeah, stay tuned for that.